Hello, everyone. Thank you for joining us today. We are from Kyoto University's Kyoto IAP Admissions Office. Today, we are going to talk about Kyoto University and our scholarship program for international undergraduate students called Kyoto IAP. So, please stay with us until the end. This is an overview of our presentation. It is divided into three parts. First, we'd like to introduce Kyoto City, where Kyoto University is located. After that, we are going to talk about why you should choose to study at Kyoto University, focusing on its features and strength. Lastly, we will provide details about the Kyoto IAP program, including the overview of the program, the benefits of the program, how to apply, and so on. Now, let's get started. To begin with, let's take a look at Kyoto City, where Kyoto University is located. Kyoto University is located in the central part of Kyoto City. But do you know where Kyoto is? Well, Kyoto is located directly north of Osaka and far to the west of Tokyo, the capital city of Japan. It takes roughly two hours to travel from Tokyo to Kyoto by bread train. Kyoto City is an ideal place for study and research for three main reasons. The first is Kyoto is a historical and cultural city. It has many historical sites, traditional rituals, and festivals. In Kyoto, there are more than 2,000 temples and shrines, including 17 UNESCO World Heritage Sites. You can see the beauty of its traditions everywhere. So Kyoto is the best place to feel and learn about history and culture of Japan. The second reason is, Kyoto is widely recognized as a highly innovative city. For example, I imagine you know about Super Mario or that you already watched the Super Mario Bros. movie. I also expect you know about Pikachu in Pokemon and a video game called Animal Crossing. These were produced by Nintendo and it might surprise you know that its headquarters are in Kyoto. In addition to Nintendo, Kyoto is home to many world-renowned companies such as Kyocera, Omron, Rome, Kyoto Animation, and so forth. So as we can see, Kyoto City is well known as a city in which ancient culture and tradition coexist side by side with innovative technology. The third reason is, Kyoto is a true university town. The rich and unique cultural background of Kyoto City has brought over 30 universities to Kyoto, which makes it a true university town. Actually, it is estimated that about 10% of the population are college or university students. So, as there are so many universities in Kyoto, as well as all around the world, why you should choose Kyoto University? The first reason is that it is one of the best universities in Asia and ranked highly in various world university rankings, as you can see from the figures here. So why does Kyoto University rank highly in the world rankings? What are the reasons? It is largely because Kyoto University is a research-oriented university. Kyoto University, or KU for short, has traditionally focused on research and has always been a leading university in Japan. It has 10 faculties or undergraduate schools, 18 graduate schools, and 39 research institutes. So the university is truly comprehensive and is strong in diverse research fields. These qualities have produced many award-winning researchers. Now, take a look at these 11 illustrious researchers. In fact, 
KU has the largest number of Nobel Prize recipients among all Asian universities. In addition, looking at the number of Nobel laureates from 2001 to 2020 by country, Japan has the second highest number. Don't forget about these researchers either. We also have recipients of the Fields Medal, Gauss Medal, and Chern Medal. Two out of three Japanese Fields Medalists are from KU, and among all five recipients of the Gauss Medal, the only Japanese national is Dr. Ito, and he's from KU. Likewise, out of all four Chern Medalists, Dr. Kashiwara is the only Japanese national, and he's from KU. There's no Nobel Prize for mathematics, but these are the most prestigious awards, and they are generally recognized as the Nobel Prizes for mathematicians. Furthermore, Professor Takuro Mochizuki received the 2022 Breakthrough Prize. In mathematics. This award was established in 2014, and he is the first Japanese national to receive the prize. Many KU researchers have won other prestigious international awards as well. So, the strength of Kyoto University is that it produces innovative, cutting edge research and cultivates award winning researchers. Following in the footsteps of those prominent researchers, many talented students from all over the world are studying at Kyoto University. As we can see from the pie charts here, we have more than 22,600 students, including about 3,000 international students from about 110 countries. This international environment enables students to broaden their horizons. The university has a large number of faculty and staff members in relation to the number of students. The student to faculty ratio is 6.5 to 1. All of our professors are dedicated to education and research supervision. They encourage students to deepen their understanding of the fields in which they are interested and to create something new through independent thinking, experience, and free discussion. Academic freedom is a key feature of Kyoto University and part of what makes it unique. At Kyoto University, we provide students with diverse academic opportunities. As we said, the university has 10 undergraduate faculties and 18 graduate schools. In short, KU is a research oriented, comprehensive university with many schools and research institutes. We have prominent researchers and talented students from all over the world. These features have led to its high position in various world university rankings. All right, now I will move on to the most important part the introduction of our unique scholarship program for international undergraduate students called Kyoto IAP. What is the Kyoto IAP? If I summarize the features of Kyoto IAP, Kyoto IAP is a four and a half year program. Japanese language proficiency is not required at the outset. You can choose your faculty according to your academic interests at the time of application. This program provides comprehensive financial support, including a monthly scholarship stipend. Let's take a closer look at each feature. This is a curriculum of the program. It consists of a six month preparatory course and four year undergraduate course. Let me explain each part of the course in detail. The six month preparatory course begins in October 
and helps students prepare for the undergraduate course. Although we do not require any Japanese language proficiency at the time of application, as students will be required to have an advanced level of Japanese language proficiency during the undergraduate course, the preparatory course provides intensive Japanese language classes. Also, in order to bridge the gap between each student's local educational curriculum and the Japanese one, we provide students with some pre foundation classes in certain natural sciences and social sciences subjects in English. This is an example of the preparatory course timetable. Japanese language classes are shown in blue and light blue. Pre foundation classes are shown in yellow. You can see how intensive the Japanese language classes are. This student expects to enroll in the Faculty of Engineering, so the pre-foundation subjects are Mathematics, Physics, and Chemistry. After you complete the preparatory course and pass the required examinations called qualifying tests, you will be able to go on to the undergraduate course. Traditionally, KU values a liberal arts education, so in the first and second years, you will study liberal arts mainly in English. About 400 courses are offered in English, and you can choose classes from all major fields. As for the Japanese language classes, you will gradually move on to higher level classes, and by doing so, you will be able to take more liberal arts subjects provided in Japanese. This is a sample spring semester timetable for a sophomore student in the Faculty of Engineering. This timetable is just for reference, but the Japanese language classes are shown in blue, and the liberal arts classes are shown in green. And here, there are some specialized classes shown in orange. In the third and fourth years, students focus on specialized subjects in their chosen majors. At this point, Kyoto IEP students are required to follow the same major curriculum as Japanese students. So the classes are taught mainly in Japanese, and discussions and assignments are also conducted in Japanese. By the time of graduation, therefore, Students are expected to have acquired an academic level of Japanese proficiency. Students can choose a faculty that suits their own interests from among these eight faculties. The good news is that the Faculty of Pharmaceutical Sciences is going to join the Kyoto IAP program from the October 2024 enrollment. Please note that the faculties of Letters and Medicine do not participate in the program at this moment. Students who successfully complete the undergraduate course are awarded a bachelor's degree. Furthermore, students who want to enroll in the faculties of Science, Engineering, or Agriculture have a wide choice of departments to choose from. Our website provides detailed information about what you can study in each faculty and department, so please visit the website and check the page titled Majors and Areas of Study. Just for your information, the Faculty of Engineering has a four-year English taught program called the International Course Program of Civil Engineering ICP. If you are interested in that program, please check their website for more information. Here, I would like to share some data about the careers that international students at KU pursue after graduation. The chart on the left shows the career path of humanities students after graduation and the chart on the right shows the career path of science students after graduation. 
As you can see, most of the students are likely to stay in Japan after they graduate. Most science students go on to a graduate school in Japan, and many humanities students find employment in Japan. After graduation, some international students are employed by large, well-known Japanese companies, such as Hitachi, SoftBank, or Rakuten. Others work for foreign affiliated companies, such as Goldman Sachs Japan and Deloitte Tomatsu Consulting Japan. Kyoto IAP students have a great advantage because they can speak Japanese in addition to their own language and English. Thoroughly mastering a new language is always challenging and will take a lot of work, but we believe that it will greatly expand your future possibilities and potential. Okay, now I'm going to talk about the financial support. Which I presume many of you are curious about. This slide shows how much the initial six months preparatory course usually costs. However, if you are enrolled in Kyoto IAP, you will receive a full waiver of the admission and tuition fees. This means that for the first six months, you only have to pay the application fee, which is about 69 US dollars. And these are the fees for the four years of undergraduate course. Usually, the admission fee is about 1,976 US dollars, but Kyoto IAP students do not have to pay anything. The annual tuition is about 3,755 US dollars, but Kyoto IAP students get full or partial waivers. The amount of the exemption will be based on your academic performance. Moreover, every IAP student has a chance to be awarded our merit-based scholarship. The amount of the scholarship depends on your academic results, but the full amount is 120,000 Japanese yen per month. It will be provided as a living allowance for up to four and a half years throughout the whole program. So far, all IAP students have obtained this scholarship. The average living expenses of undergraduate students at KU is 90,000 Japanese yen per month, so the scholarship is easily enough for student life in Kyoto City. To summarize, if you receive all the financial support provided by the university, all you need to pay is about 188 US dollars, which is the total amount of the application fees for the preparatory course and undergraduate course. Regarding accommodation, Kyoto IAP students can live in one of the university dormitories. For example, the Hyakumanben International House is available for the first two years. All students have their own private furnished room and share the kitchen, laundry, shower rooms, and toilets. You can enjoy cooking and talking with your friends in the dining room. Perhaps you are worried about whether you can keep up with your classes, or you might be worried about life in Japan. There's no need to worry, as various kinds of support are available on campus. For example, support from tutors, and teaching assistants, and professional advice from the International Students Advising Office. Events and workshops at the Student Lounge, Kizuna, enable students to enjoy international exchange and make new friends. Students also receive support from the Kyoto IAP faculty and staff members, and the senior students are always ready to help you. Of course, Kyoto IAP students can join clubs and circles and participate in the many university events, just as other Japanese and international students do. Now let me explain application process. First, you have to submit an application through the online application system 
between early November and early December. Then we'll make the admissions offer in early April. The number of places available is 25 to 30, but we will announce the exact number of the places in the application guidelines. That is the total number of successful applicants from all over the world. We release the application guidelines in every July, so please check the guidelines for more information. Before applying for Kyoto IAP, please confirm that you are eligible by checking the eligibility requirements in the application guidelines. Next, be sure to pay the application fee by credit card and prepare the application documents. These documents are especially important. Your passport or photo ID. Your high school transcript. A certificate of expected graduation. An evaluation form, which you ask your teachers to fill out. The result of an English proficiency test, such as TOEFL and IELTS. Native speakers of English can submit Form C instead. The result of a standardized test, such as the SAT, EJU, ACT, etc. Please refer to the application guidelines for details. And do not forget to show your motivation in the essay, okay? For further details, please visit the Kyoto IAP website and check the latest updates as well as the application guidelines on the How to Apply page. You can download the application guidelines for the October 2024 enrollment there. An FAQ is also available on the website. Alright, that brings me to the end of our presentation. We hope you have become interested in studying at Kyoto University and applying for Kyoto IAP. We hope to see you here in Kyoto in the near future. Also, don't forget to follow our official Instagram and YouTube channel. Thank you for listening and thank you for your attention. See you!